Okay. Mark, we love this kind of stuff. Magic, yeah. mind reading. How did you get fascinated with this? I've been doing this for like 25 years. I'm from a really small town, so at first it was boredom. <laughs> right? I didn't have yeah. much to do. And then um, uh, eventually I found that I just love being on stage. So my outlet for that was magic. And then I got into psychology and theater. I went to USC out in LA to say acting. So it was kind of a combination of all those things. And uh, by the time I came out of uh, USC, I was like a full blown mind reader. So you're a Trojan. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah. So. Right. So can you read anyone's mind? Can you read women's minds? I do my best. I've been married, <laughs> I've been married for eight years. So yeah, totally he's asking because he wants some of that power. Can you <laughs> yeah. give that power to other we'll people? Want to talk off camera? You're asking. <laughs> yeah. That's it. That's it. Uh, so how does it work? How does the mind reading actually work? Is it is it real? Is it a is it a facade? How does it happen? I'm a very skeptical person, so I I don't claim any supernatural ability. I'm not psychic or anything like okay. that. You're not a medium. Um, no, no, right. I want to I do that. Um, so uh, in, instead, it's psychological illusions, mysteries of the mind. Uh, in fact, I, I tell people in, in my show here in Chicago every week that it is uh, all about mystery. So like instead of an artist with paint or a musician with melody, I work with mystery. So hopefully the audience leaves with some kind of paradox in their mind of how could he possibly do that? Right. They're not thinking I'm real, just something to ponder yeah. over for a few months. To or entertain something. us. Yeah, you're right. All right, exactly. let's do something. Let's try something. Okay, All right. so Ryan, think of, can I come closer? Think yeah. of someone you know that okay. I couldn't possibly know, a friend, family member, someone like that. I okay, got it. Okay, great. Let me give you this. Would you mind jotting it down? Sure. Don't say it, because okay. that's not my treating, it's listening. Um, <laughs> I'll have you write it right here, and then fold it back up. I'll get it okay. for you in just a second. Okay. And then Val, I have a book for you. Okay. This is a book I've been reading lately. Okay. Would you flip through and just confirm for the audience, for everyone watching at home, okay. that is in fact- Yeah, A Case a of Intuition, yeah, 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 by Jack Harlan. Yeah, 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 just flip through it there, perfect. Right, I'll show you this. I cannot see through that. I won't, I won't peek. Look, okay. I can't see through this. Are right. you right-handed, left-handed? I'm right-handed. Okay, hold that for me and just tuck it down inside of my uh, pocket there on the side. Okay. Perfect. We will only look at that to confirm in a moment. All right. For now, you happy with this? Yeah. Look, yeah. great. I am. I'll grab this ring. I'm going to go through like this. I'll look away. Okay. Just say stop when you're ready. Okay, stop. Perfect. Can you remember that word right up there? Yep. Got it? Okay. Concentrate on that. I'll let you hold that. Okay. Just picture the word and imagine saying it to me over and over, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. So you say this word over and over. It's quite a short word, yes? Three or four letters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're saying it very quickly in your mind. So imagine saying it. Um, <laughs> something like soft or something. Uh, is that right? It's soft. It's soft. Very good. Let's do, let's do another. That's just getting in sync with you. So I said soft to him with my eyes. That Ryan. was very good. Yes. Yeah. Are you getting soft? Is a, uh, that, that's just a warm up to get in sync. So do, right. do a better one. Do a better one. Any word, any page, Stop. any paragraph. You no, no, you go in there. Any paragraph, any sentence, a long word. Do super long because mm. the soft's too easy. Can I so, look at the word too? Yeah, you can look at it. 10, right. 12, 15 okay. letters. Let's do that. Something one. interesting. Yep. Yep. Is it really yep. long yep. though? Yep. Is yep. it it's super long. long? Okay, here, I'll grab that from you. Just imagine saying it over and over in your mind now. Quite a long word now, yes? Yeah, okay, yeah. Good, good. It's pretty long. Okay, good. Um, Oh, there's the, there are those eyes again. Yeah. Okay, um, those eyes are playing with you, aren't uh, they? <laughs> um, just think the first letter. This is harder when it's longer. Just think the first letter. I'm getting like a. This might be wrong. I'm getting like a J or a K. Is it a J or a K? No. Maybe there was another word that started with that. Um, what's the first letter? Not the whole word. What's the first letter? What's my name? <laughs> Val. Does it start with a V? Yes. Oh, okay. That's good. Is that why you chose it, or just random? No, it's just random. Okay, so imagine saying the whole word, because this is what I, this is weird. Is this a weird word to think of or something? It seems kind of... It's not common. Yeah, that's, that's what's throwing me off. Yeah, it's not um, common. It's a long word. Imagine saying the whole... You're breaking it up, too, so there's sections, right? There's like a word within the word or something like that, right? Okay, so imagine saying the whole uh, video cassette. Wow. That's unreal. That, that's the word. That that I saw the word. word. Very good, very so good. So how did you do that? How did you do that? That's not how did you do My eyes that? gave it away? Yeah, you were pretty Hold good. Hold on, let me look at that. I got DVD. I got DVD. <laughs> you might. Well, I, get, no, I get you Blu-ray. <laughs> so Ryan, you have HD. A, you have a name in 4K. And this, I do. The point of doing this is to kind of get warmed up and get in sync, which is kind of how I deal with people. So now that we've got in sync, let's do something more personal, which is the name. So imagine saying the name to me. And we'll kind of do it in sections. So to me, I think this is like a friend. Is this just a close friend or nope. something like that? Is it family member? Yep. Okay. So imagine it written here instead. We'll do it different. Imagine it here, like the marquee of the Chicago Theater. You see it here in nice big letters. This is what's interesting right away. It is, um, it's like a nickname or, or an abbreviated version of a name or something like that, something along those lines. Uh, sort of. Yeah, 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 yeah. So imagine saying, is it a guy's name? Yes. Is it like a brother or? No. Nope. You think differently than Val. Um, this <laughs> is, um, uh, I, don't, I, I don't have it written all over my we're eyes. Kind of the um, we're kind of the same, but um, <laughs> slightly creepy, but that's why. Um, this, is, this is what I think. Are you a Libra? 
I am. You are a Libra because you're different than Val. You're like a guess. Uh, oh, uh, Pisces. Yes. Yes. Very good. Wow. Um, what I think is it would be something like this. Um, would you mind, before I show, would you tell everyone what name did you think of? The name is Eddie. That's my dad's name. What's your dad? Something like that. <gasps> oh. Wow. That's so cool. That was wild. And his, yes. his real name is Edward, or his official name, so oh, Eddie is... a little is, bit of a nickname. Oh, exactly yeah. what I said. I said sort of. Wow. I think that's 100% technically, so that's pretty... I give you 100%. And you do this every week. You have a show every week. Yeah, up in Lincoln Park, um, Wednesdays at 8 p.m. at the Greenhouse Theater. Um, and when I'm not there, I'm, I travel. I go on tour. Right now, I'm in the middle of a five-city international tour. Just got back from Ontario. I head to San Diego next week. And then I come back between the tour to do the show here on Wednesday. You guys should go check him out. That was unreal. That was incredible. Yeah. I don't know how you did that. I, I want to know, too. Are you it's looking at eyes. a facial expression? It's, or a, you... it's a lot. It's intuition. It's psychology. And there's a little trickery going on. I'll, I'll be completely honest. But hopefully it feels magical. It feels mysterious. And you leave with some kind of good feeling of wonder. Yeah, I'm really I impressed. wonder where the yeah. trickery comes yeah. in. All right. You can catch Mark on Wednesdays, as you just heard, at the Greenhouse Theater. Head to WindyCityLive.com for all of the details.